What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBASafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back with another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today, we got some market talk. We got some new content. The worst content I've ever seen. But yeah, before we get into the video, make sure to smash that like button, all that good stuff. That would be greatly appreciated. Um, Really, bro, we're getting closer and closer to 10K. My vids yesterday, with the support you guys gave me, was absolutely incredible. So please, man, that, 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 that was just amazing, man. The support... Has been absolutely amazing. As you guys do know, we do have content. It's terrible. Um, make sure to smash the like button, drop the sub, and all that good stuff. Because honestly, that would be greatly appreciated. Now we're gonna get some snip. We're gonna get some snipe filters, kind of some tips and all that good stuff. Make sure to follow Twitter if you do want to sell your MT or buy MTs. I have both. But yeah, if you guys don't know, this is the content. This is the worst content I've ever seen. It's so ass. Um, if you guys haven't realized, man, 2K's content has been really, really terrible. I mean. This is why I'm going to say this, because first off, the LeBron pack is terrible. None of those cards are usable besides LeBron. Um, literally, I mean, Draymond's usable, but dude, oh my god. Like, you're not going to pull the Opals in those packs. Those packs are so rigged. I pulled a ton of them. Literally. Terrible. Like, I promise you, man, those packs are so bad. These packs are bad. The content has been bad. I mean, it's just really annoying. So, I, I'm just going to sit here and continue to be on the market. The pack lot, the pack gods are trash. They they haven't dropped any prime sets. They haven't dropped anything like valuable. They haven't dropped anything to like make the market interesting. The market has been absolutely dry. It's straight up just been um what's it called? It's straight up just been all about the spotlight sims. And like more than I would say 70% of the community is not grinding those because I'm not taking 70 hours of my day to get those opals. Yeah, they're sick opals, but I can't. I cannot sit there and look at this the auction block is down again so um i don't even know what to say um this is literally getting out of hand the auction house is down so now what the hell should you be doing i have no idea i don't even know what the hell to say this is absolutely insanely ridiculous um right now the game is impossible to play i literally i this is why i haven't been playing literally the auction is broken what am i supposed to do i cannot play the game anymore it's simply broken so now it actually happened hours before it's 12 10 which means the auction block has crashed um literally seven hours before what it usually does it ah, six hours i would say it usually happens at six but you know what since the auction is down this is what you should be doing so if you guys want oh i'm so mad see like all those cars that i just saw over two hours are all now gone so i'm gonna bid on this blake hope for the best now, let's see if I go back in if he's gone. He's still there. He should be gone in a second. Now, this is going to make... This is how I'm going to make MT. This bird, I'll bid on him. I'll bid on him, too. Let's see. What else? We'll bid on this Luca. We'll put it up to two-something. Hopefully, it goes away. 174. Now, we're going to see if we can make a lot of MT this way. It looks like we should be able to. We already got outbid on the Luca. So, now, hopefully, this is how we're going to make MT. Now, these cards, there's only 3 hours and 46 minutes. Unless there's a certain way you can see these cards, I don't think there is. So, the market's stuck at around 3 hours and 46 minutes. And now, oh, look, these cards are popping up now. So, I'll bid on this Dirk. I'll bid on... I'm literally just going to bid all my MT on these cards and just hope I get them. Because, simply, if no one else can see them and I'm the only one that can see them, I'm going to make a lot of MT. This is probably going to be the best way to make MT right now. This Hito for 199 I'll bid on that. Kuzma for 100 now. I just got to pray that these cards do go away. Like, I don't know if these people... I don't know if people could see these cards, but I don't know. We'll see. I bid on all these cards. Now, hopefully, this is how I'm going to make MT. Hopefully, the market does go poof. Now, if the market goes poof, no one can see these cards besides me. I'm going to get every single one of these cards, and nobody knows. Like, I will snipe out this Luca Bird. <laughs> like, if I get all these cards right now with the market going away... I'm going to make over 100,000 per card about. Like, I'll make probably 40K off him, a solid 100K off him, a solid 50K off him, a solid 100K off him, a solid 100K off him, and a solid 50K off him. 
If this works out, we're gonna make a lot of MT. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I really have no, like, I really can't do anything about it. So, we're just gonna pray. Hopefully, it does go my way. But now, this is some snipe filters I'm going to tell you. Um, some deadly snipe filters. Pink Diamond snipe filter is really good. Now, also, with the new content, since these packs aren't really popping off, I would honestly go Pink Diamond Spotlight Sim and, sni and Snipe on there if you have the MT. Um, Pink Diamond Spotlight Sim is going to be a very, very lethal method of making MT. And I really think you guys should definitely try it. So what you want to do is pretty much put your max bid to whatever and just continue to refresh um, right here. Let's see if we get something real quick. Jared Dudley's all those dudes. So yeah. As you can see, bro, Brian Reed's been getting posted for the low recently. He's terrible. So now what you want to do drop it a couple thousand scroll a little bit see what pops up right now it's looking dry pretty much you just want to look for the newer cards besides brian reeves so this night filter is going to be really good you could also do it diamond wise too because they did drop some pretty decent diamonds um on the spotlight sim side so we'll check that out the diamond spotlight sim filter has been good for a while and then you could also do the ami filter um pretty much you want to just stay away from darnell armstrong and all that good stuff because it's a really, really good idea to do so, I would say. Okay, so now, since the auction block has been weird, like, I'm gonna go over it, like, I don't know how it's going to work exactly, like, so it's stuck at 3 hours and 42 minutes. I don't know if people can see, like, the auction actually, like, going down, but all I know, dude, I literally don't even want to, like, if I were you, don't even look at Opals right now, like, to make MT... I would literally just stay away from opals because like at this point i don't even know what's going on like i don't know what is going to happen to the auction i don't even know anymore like straight up it's so risky to bid on these opals it's so risky to do anything involved with opals and i it's literally scary like if i were you guys and you wanted to make mt right now i would stick to pink diamond and under because opals bro with the whole buyout with the whole bs situation it's so so scary like right now you can't snipe you really can't do anything so with that being said i don't even know what to say like oh my god i i don't even know like you could try sniping these opals on here yeah they're gonna pop up that's not an issue they're popping up fine the market's moving quick it's just let's say you snipe out a ben simmons and you put him up and then you only gain like 50k it's like what the hell dude i just sniped ben simmons and he can't even sell for 300,000 mt so like oh right now it's so scary like straight up what are you gonna do pink diamond wise opal wise i don't even know anymore like this game isn't even playable so pretty much i don't even know man stick to the spotlight sim filter hopefully the market is not stupid and broken but um you could honestly if you want spotlight sim regular filter you don't even really have to uh you don't even really have to put anything you can honestly just go to like 5k and refresh the spotlight sim that way because you never know when kids are going to put up the diamond cards or the ami cards for the low. Like, as you can see, this Steve Novak for 4200 I could probably pick up both of those and sell them for 50 something Because, bro, this is a very good budget Amethyst card. He's a corner. He's a sharpshooter. He's going to make a lot of threes. He has gold range. So, honestly, this filter is going to be really solid as well, um, straight up. So, definitely try out this filter. Spotlight Sim filter regularly. Like, Anthony Tolliver for 5500 I think he's worth a lot more than that. We're about to find out. I have a couple of him as well and also dvd did drop a video so 5500 6500 so i can make a solid 500 mt off him right there so that's pretty good hopefully his price does rise because i do believe he is out of packs all those cards the javon carter all those ami cards they're all out of packs so if you do pay attention to those prices you could make a lot of mt um but seriously my top side filters right now are gonna be pink diamond diamond filter 4000 buyout amethyst filter and I would say probably Galaxy Opal because honestly, there's not a lot up right now. It's just the whole problem is that you might have an issue popping those up. You know what I'm saying? So it's totally up to you. It's totally how you approach this. Personally, me, myself, I'm honestly really haven't really been playing 2K because I like to work the market. And the fact that it's scary to post cards, I kind of just backed away. So yeah, hope you guys did enjoy the video just stay prepared just watch out for the auction house glitch watch out to see what you're doing watch out watch out watch out watch out snipe lower tiers honestly you can't really snipe out opals it's broken like simply i'm refreshing and like old cards are popping up so yeah that's all i got for the video hope you guys enjoyed stay tuned for more content have a good one Peace.